In this video, I'm going to talk about how you get Excel to fit a line to some data for you. Excel's not very clever. It can't handle the fact that error bars might not all be the same, and it can't really give you uncertainties in your error parameters, but it will give you a good first guess. And once you have a first guess at the best fit, you can then construct a model using either Excel or Python and adjust it and see how much you can adjust it while it still fits the error bars OK, as we discussed earlier in the course. So here we have some data, lots of x values, lots of y values, and some uncertainties. Let's plot them. So we'll select the data, go up to charts, scatter, mark to scatter. And here we have it. Now we can select the points and go to chart layout, error bars, error bar options. Custom, specify value. That's for the positive values. And now for the negative values. Okay. It's given you error bars on both X and Y, so we'll click on, I don't want the X ones, click on them, press delete, and there we have it. A plot with error bars. Now to fit a line to it, it's very simple. Just click on any of the data points, right click add trend line and it gives you a series of options you can add a linear trend line a straight line or other things you can for example add a polynomial and give it whatever order you like but normally it's just a straight line then you click options get it to display the equation on the chart and there you have it y equals 0.0429x that's the slope plus 1.2071 in this case and that's all there is to it uh, you could then create a, a model, as we talked about before, and adjust it to see what fits through the data, but this will get you a good first guess.